As a Pokemon YouTuber, I'm often asked what my favorite Pokemon is, and while that question is pretty simple, it gets a lot more difficult when people try to get into the specifics. I don't know my favorite electric type off the top of my head, and I definitely don't know my favorite fighting type from the third generation off the top of my head. That was until I stumbled upon this website that's gonna allow me to go through and figure out my favorite Pokemon of every single typing from every single generation, along with a bunch of other questions that I've never answered before. This is gonna be a lot of fun, and even more fun is the possibility of doing this all again with the shiny forms. If that's something you wanna see, hey, let me know in the comments and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it when I upload that video, if you guys want me to upload that video. But beauty of this website, we just click here, there's all the options. And when I look at the Gen 1 normal Pokemon, it's kind of difficult. There's a few Pokemon here that I really like, but I think it's gotta be Snorlax. I like Eevee, but I like a lot of its evolutions more than Eevee itself. Snorlax though, come on, it's Snorlax. Fire type, this one's a lot easier. It's basic, but I'm picking Charizard every time. Come on, what did you expect? Water, hmm, this is tough. But I think it's gotta be Poliwrath. I loved Poliwrath as a kid, and I started in Gen 1. I didn't know we would get Politoed, so Poliwrath was my favorite frog-like Pokemon. Yeah, I always tried to get all of the holographic Poliwrath cards. It was one of my favorites. Grass. I really like Executor, but I think it's... I think it's probably Bulbasaur. He's a cute little guy. Look at this guy. Look at this little frog dude. Come on. Electric. This one's tough because I love Jolteon and I love Zapdos. Wow, I actually don't know. I think Zapdos. Jolteon's one of my favorite evolutions, but it's not my favorite overall, and I really love Zapdos. I always got it when I'd play Pokemon Yellow. I always wanted it on the team. I feel like it's overhated. It just has a special place in my heart. I love it. Ice, come on, this is easy. Cloyster, fighting, that is so easy. Poison. <laughs> a lot of options, but it's actually pretty easy. It's definitely Nidoking. One of the cooler Pokemon they've ever made. Ground? I don't want to do any repeats. I don't think that gets me anywhere. I always had a soft spot for Golem. Flying though. Oh, this is tough. I don't think I want to do any duplicates, so I'm going to pick something new. I think Aerodactyl. I really liked the fossils as a kid. I thought that was a really, really cool one. Psychic. I feel like it's weird not to choose Mewtwo or Mew, but I've always loved Alakazam. It was one of my favorites as a kid. It's still one of my favorites now. I really love it. Bug. Yeah, that's got to be Scyther. Come on. It's got to be. Rock. This is tough, but I've already picked Golem. And I've already picked Aerodactyl. I think that leaves me with Kabutops. Kabutops is very, very cool. The two Scythe guys same, next same, to each same. other, it just, it, it makes sense in my mind. And with the Ghosty Ghost, come on. <laughs> the Dragony Dragon, boop, come on. What? <laughs> You gotta pick Missing Gnome, or Missing No. I don't think that's a gnome, but I'm not entirely sure. Magneton, Lefable, Starter though, wow. I know it's so basic, but I used to play Leaf Green over and over and over again, and I would just always choose Charizard, and half the time I try to solo the game just with Charizard. But they say variety is the spice of life, so thankfully the sponsor of this video, Honkai Impact 3rd, has me covered with a brand new game to play. Honkai Impact 3rd is an action role-playing game where players control a team of Valkyries as they battle against supernatural enemies in a future post-apocalyptic world. The game features immersive stories, stunning graphics, and open-world exploration, all wrapped up in a cross-platform game available on iOS, Android, PC, Steam, and Epic. And with a new version of the game on the way, you can expect some exciting updates like Seal's new S-rank Hersher Battlesuit, Hersher of Rebirth. But that's not all. With new events such as Chasing Light, Drinking Shadow, and Before the Endless Dream Ends, both of these should provide a lot of extra content to play through. Hoyoverse is coming to GamesCon from August 23rd to 27th. Captains, it's time to enjoy the great event with Valkyries. Click on the link below for more event details. So what are you waiting for? Download Honkai Impact 3rd and use redeem code REBIRTH to get tons of in-game rewards. And for new players, you guys will have even more in-game bonus to explore. Gimmick form. Chonky Pikachu. This is a close one between Chonkachu and Mega Charizard X, but I gotta go with Mega Charizard X as it's one of the coolest designs we've ever gotten. Legend, I think it's probably Mewtwo. Zapdos is still one of my favorites, but I mean, Mewtwo's Mewtwo, and I, I'm, a, I'm a Gen 1 guy. Like, come on, it's, it's Mewtwo. Favorite overall, that's easy. It's Machamp, not even a question. Gen 2 is gonna be odd because there's only so many Pokemon, so let's see how this goes, but to start, 
It's Dunsparce. I've always loved Dunsparce. Fire. Ooh. Probably Cyndaquil. <laughs> and water. <gasps> Politoed. I actually really liked Mantine as a kid and Quillfish. And I love Totodile and Frilligator, but Politoed. Grass. Okay. I do not really like any of these guys. Life is pain. You know, I might actually pick Bayleaf. I think it's one of the coolest middle starter Pokemon. Even though I really don't love Chikorita or Meganium, I really do like Bayleaf. There's just something about it. It's really cool. Electric. Ooh. Raikou. Ice. Swine up. Look at this little guy. Come on. Fighting. Everyone wanted to get a Heracross in Gen 2. It was so rare, so cool, so powerful still. I just don't like when it mega evolves into a garden gnome, okay? Poison? I really loved Spinarak as a kid. I, I think I still love it. It's a cute little guy. Ground. I mean, it's between these three, and it, it is probably Fampy at the end of the day. I, I do love the other two as well. I mean, they're all like close to elephants. You know, Pileswan turns into a mammoth. And I do love Dawn Fan, but it's Fampy. Lion. Hmm. I always had a soft spot for Gligar. Psychic? Oh, oh, I might have a really unique answer here. Unknown J. I got a promo Unknown J Pokemon card and I loved it. My name's John. I've always loved the letter J. Bug? It might be Yanma. It might be Yanma from this gen. I feel like I should say Scizor, but I think it's Yanma. Tyranitar. I mean, come on, it's Godzilla. Well, <laughs> sometimes it's easy. Ooh, sometimes. Hound Doom's pretty sick. Steel. That's how we sneak Scizor in here. Uh, it worked out in the end. Yeah, come on. A little Pika Blue never hurt nobody. Starter, though. I don't know if I've ever picked a favorite between Cyndaquil and Totodile, but the answer's for Alligator. I couldn't pick between the two baby forms, but I do think I was able to pick with the final form. I really love for Alligator. Gimmick form. The problem with Megas is I only look at them competitively speaking, and I'm trying to figure out which one of these I like competitively rather than like design. I I think it's Mega Scizor, I don't know. Legend, I think it's probably Ho-Oh. And favorites, ooh, it's Politoed. It's gotta be Politoed. Gen three, lot of new Pokemon in this one. Let's start with normal. I have no idea. I think it's Zangoose. I only had Sapphire as a kid, and the idea of Zangoose was really, really cool. I never really got it. So in my mind, it's a much cooler Pokemon and like a better Pokemon than it probably really is. But it's always just seems so cool. Fire. Yeah, this is easy. <laughs> Water. Lot of options. This is a really tough one. There's a lot of Pokemon that could work here. And I might use some of these Pokemon in different typings. I'm going back and forth, but I think I got to go with Pelipper. I was the New Orleans Pelippers for many years in Draft League. It's just had a really big part of my like online career and a big part of my life. So it's got to be Pelipper. Grass. This is easy. I really, really loved Trico. I almost always picked it. I love Trico. Electric. Anectric. There's not many options. Ice. This is where I take Sfield. One of the cutest Pokemon ever created. Biting. This is difficult because it's definitely Blaziken. So I think over here, I may make this Torchic because I do really like Torchic and I do really like Blaziken. And I think that's a better balance. It makes more sense in my brain. Poison to Viper. Ground. Ooh. Flygon's pretty cool. Flying. I love Rayquaza. Uh, I'm, I'm picking Rayquaza. I don't even care. Psychic's kind of tough in this gen. They keep throwing this Dark Lugia out there. This doesn't count. I'm not picking Dark Lugia. I, I don't think that works, but I think this one's probably Metagross. Bug. Oh, wow. Is it Wurple? Is there a chance that I'm going to pick Wurple here? I think I'm going to go with Wurple. I don't know. It's my gut reaction. Look at it. Shining like a superstar. Rock. Agron. Come on. It's easy. Little ghosty ghost. I think Sableye. Dragon, though. I'm going to pick Rayquaza again for Legend. So I'm going to go Salamence here. It kind of looks like a toad. And I'm starting to love it more and more as time goes on. Dark. I think Cacturn. I was born in Arizona and I lived there a few years. There were a lot of saguaro cacti or cacti, I guess I should say. And we need more cacti. Maractus doesn't count. Steel. I'll put Aeron here. I like Aeron. I, I kind of wanted to put Aggron a second time, but I like both of them being represented here. Fairy. It's probably Gardevoir. People have gotten so weird about Gardevoir that like... 
starter? It's probably Trico. I really love Blaziken, but then we got so many more firefighting starters that it, it, it lost a little bit of its shine, its luster. But I've always loved Trico. Gimmick form. There's a lot. <laughs> there are a lot. Probably Mega Rayquaza. What a ridiculous Pokemon. Why did they make that? In Legend, it's gotta be Rayquaza. You already know. And my favorite here... It's got to be Rayquaza. Come on. Gen 4, home of my favorite game, Platinum, Staraptor, Fire, Infernape, Water. Oh, I actually don't know. Probably Empoleon. A pretty cool Mon. Grass, Roserade. I really like that as an evolution. Electric, Luxray, Ice, Mamoswine, Fighting. Ooh, do I do Infernape again or do I do Toxicroak? I do Toxicroak. I would definitely do Toxicroak there. I love Infernape, one of my favorite starters, but he's a fighting frog. That's very cool. Poison. I think I actually do Toxicroak here than Lucario here. I think that works a little bit better because I do really like Lucario. Ground though. I'm actually just going to do Mamoswine again. It's my favorite Pokemon. Spoilers. He's, he's going to be on the list every time I have the option to choose it. That's just how it goes. Flying. It's this column right here. It's one of these three. But we've already done Staraptor. I think Gliscor. I really, really liked Gliscor. Glade's a sick evolution. The fourth gen Evos were awesome. Give us more awesome Evos like this. Not like the Dunspark like Gallade and Gliscor, please. And of course, Mamoswine, the greatest of them all. Bug, a fourth gen Evo, of course. Rock, I love the idea of Rhyperior. I've never loved how it looked, but I still really like it. And I don't know how that makes sense, but it does. And here we are. Ghost, probably Giratina. It's just which one of these forms do I like more? I think I like them standing a little bit, a little bit scarier. Dragon, Garchomp, Dark, Honchcrow, Steel, Hmm. I think maybe Dialga. I had a diamond before Pearl, and me and my sister would go back and forth having battles. I'd have Dialga, she'd have Palkia. I really like Dialga. Fairy, Togekiss. <laughs> Starter. Oh, we take Infernape. Gimmick form. I think it's Gallade with a cape. <laughs> Legend. Giratina barely. And it's mostly because of its shiny form, but I, I, I think it still wins. And my favorite overall? Come on. It's Mamoswine. But on to Gen 5. I think this is the biggest new Pokedex yet, and it starts off very interesting. What am I gonna choose out of these Pokemon? I think Stoutland, I like dogs. Fire though, I think it's Chandelure. I always really love that Mon, it's really cool. Water, Timpole or Seismitoad. Probably Seismitoad, <laughs> he's a silly dude. Grass, at this point it's probably Verizion. Everywhere I look, I see Verizion. Keeps following me, man, it's, I can't escape it. Electric, I really liked Electros, but I also really like Galvantula. My gut said Galvantula, so I'm going with it. Ice, Dragonal. I don't think it gets a lot of love from other people, but for some reason, I always like this thing. But fighting, I know that's gonna be Terrakion. I really, really love Terrakion. Poison, probably this dude. Ground, probably Golurk. I said Golurk and clicked Crocodile, and that only shows how divided I am. But I would pick Golurk here for Ghost, since I've already picked Chandelure, so I think it works. My heart, it's happy. Flying, probably Tornadus T. A really silly design, but I loved using it competitively, and that gives it an edge. Psychic. Reuniclus. Come on. Blobby. Bug. Ooh, I like Genesect, but I, I think it's Spokarona. Rock. I don't want to say Terrakion again. If I had to choose something else, I guess Archeops. Dragon, though. Nah, it's got to be Haxorus. I remember when this was first revealed. It was way before we got the games. I thought this was one of the coolest designs I had ever seen in my life. I don't think it gets enough love for how sick of a Pokemon. Pokemon it is. I'm actually still kind of shocked it wasn't the pseudo legendary. Dark. Scrafty or Bisharp? I feel like it might be Bisharp at this point. Steel. Probably Ferrothorn. Fairy. What was it got? I don't know. <laughs> Starter. This is where I can pick Samurai. Gimmick. What? There's only two? I guess Trash Mountain? <laughs> Legend. Yeah, it's probably still Terrakion. I really like Terrakion. Verizion has not beaten Terrakion out yet. Maybe that's why it's chasing me. I don't know. A Favorite Gen 5 Mon. Wow, I've never considered this question. Wow, I really like all these Pokemon. I think it's probably Reuniclus. I fell in love using this Pokemon competitively and it just... 
I don't know. It's a Pokemon that's stuck around. It's not as big of a part of my channel these days, but I just have always had a soft spot for Reuniclus. Time for Gen 6. Starting with normal, which is always very difficult. I think it's Diggersby. Fire, though. Me Mega Charizard X? I didn't know Megas would count here, so... Feels right. Water? Yeah, no, no, it's Froakie here, and then let's just get it over with. Th this is Greninja. Let's, let's not beat around the bush. That's easy. Grass? I always liked Trevenant. He's a cool dude. He's a he's a tree guy. Grr, he's a tree. Electric. Nah, he's probably the dressed up Pikachu. He's gonna he's gonna go do Pikachu things in this outfit. It's great. Everyone loves this. Hi, right, man. Come on. Yeah, throw me a bone. What are these options? Dude's a table. Fighting. Aluja's pretty sick. Poison. I feel like I always said this guy's name wrong. Dragalge, Dragalgi, I don't know. Seahorsey dude. Ground. Zygo? I think flying. I mean, if you're going to give me Rayquaza, I'm going to pick it every time. So let's let's just do that. Psychic. Gen 6 is not giving me a lot to work with. I'll be honest. I guess it's got to be Mega Glade. Bug. Mega Pinsir. Pinsir actually becoming very strong and usable with Sweet, especially since it never got the evolution it deserved. So I really like that it got a good Mega. Rock. Ooh, I really like the dinos. Come on. A T-Rex. It's very sick. Ghosty Ghost. Aegislash every single time. One of my favorite Pokemon ever, ever. Dragon. I actually really love Gudra. Did not think I would like that Pokemon. Used it competitively, became one of my favorites. He's a silly guy. Other Aegislash form. <laughs> Fairy. Yellow Florgis. Starter though. Oh, do I do Froakie or Greninja? Probably Froakie, because you start with Froakie and he's a cute little dude. Gimmick. It's like all of them. Um, Mega Charizard X just looks so sick. Legends. Picking Mega Rayquaza again feels very lame. They turn Zygarde into a dog. That's very cool. I think I'm going to do that. I. It's very random and I kind of love it. Favorite overall? I don't know if it's Aegislash or Froakie. It's probably Froakie. It's, it's closer than it maybe should be, but it's Froakie. All right, Gen 7, what do you got for me? Not a lot here. Silvalli and Type Null are really interesting Pokemon. I think, I think Silvalli. Fire, I think Incineroar? Water though. Ashes Greninja, don't mind if I do. Grass, oh, come on, this is easy. I'm gonna pick you here, and then we're gonna go to Ghost immediately, and I'm gonna pick you. Maybe my favorite starters of all time, and I guess I'll answer that question, so I will have to make a decision, but I really love this situation. Jui and Rylet. They're so good. Electric. Vikavolt is sick. I used to pronounce it wrong or still do, and Mikey did not love that. Ice. Probably you. I really love regional forms. It's such a cool idea. Fighting. Passimian. Poison, though. I think Salazzle. Ground. Ooh. I was gonna say Mudsdale, but I really, really love Hallow Sand. I don't know this dude very well, but I do know I love you and I love you. I love Mudsdale more competitively and I keep finding shiny Mudbray. Wait, what? That's a shiny Mudbray. I'm gonna do Mudsdale because I know in the shiny I'll do Palo Sand, okay? It's what my heart's telling me to do. Flying. Oh, I kind of done this little baby guy. I'm, I'm putting the little baby guy again. I, I, I love the little baby guy a lot. And for here, I'll probably just actually put... I'm putting Decidueye twice. It might be my favorite starter. I love it so much. Psychic. I did a lot of Ultra Wormhole hunting with this guy. He's my pal. Bug. Then I'm going to put Vikavolt here. And then I'm going to pick Pikachu with a hat over here. Because I just love the fact that he has a little hat on. And I don't think I need Vikavolt twice. I really like Lycanroc. It's a cool Pokemon. Dragon, though. Guzzlord's a really sick Pokemon. I really like this thing. I had a shiny Guzzlord, and then I somehow, like, released it or messed it up. I don't have it anymore. I got it super under odds. I'm very sad. I want my shiny Guzzlord back. Dark, though. Maybe we do Guzzlord here and Kamoo here. Steel. Uh... Uh, um, I do not have a clue. I might go with Magearna. This one, though, I'm going with Tapu Bulu. Really like that mod. He's a, he's a fun guy. Starter, Decidueye. Gimmick form. I really love the Alolan variants, but I don't know if they hit many home runs in the first go at it. Marowak's really, really cool here. I, I gotta go with that. Legend. I think it's Bulu. And favorite overall. Well, it's gotta be Decidueye. 
Come on. Gen 8. This is where it's going to get really difficult. Oh, this includes Legends Arceus. That's super interesting. Probably Asui and Zorak. That thing is so cool. Fire. I think it's Asui and Arcanine. Water. I think it's probably my boy Sobble. <laughs> Come on, look at this little dude. Man, this is tough. Why did they throw the Hisui in Pokemon here? I think it's the new Decidueye. Electric. Aw, oh, Chonkachu. Ice. Might be Ice Q. It might be Ice Q. He's a fun little dude. Fighting. Oh, this one's actually easy. It's Phalanx. No question about it. Come on, it's Phalanx. Who doesn't love Phalanx? If it's you, you're wrong. Poison. I always wanted Quillfish to get an evolution, so this thing's pretty awesome. Ground. I think my silly snake friend. Lion. Hmm. 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 I think it's Galarian Zapdos. I haven't used it a ton, but very cool to see legendaries get new forms. Psychic. I also always wanted Stantler to get an evolution, so I feel like Weird Deer is the right, right call. It's a Weird Deer. Bug. Cleavor. Rock. Ooh, I've already done Cleavor and I've already done Arcanine. Hmm. I kind of like Dreadnought, actually. He's a pretty cool early route Pokemon. Ghost. Dragapult's so sick. Now that might clash with Dragon. Duraludon was pretty sweet. I right, Dark. I think probably Grimmsnarl. Steel. Paparaja. Love elephants. Love them so much. Fairy. We do Grimmsnarl here. We go back to Dark. We whoopsie do our way into Hisui and Samurott and move to starter and of course we're gonna pick probably Hisui and Decidueye. Gimmick form, there's so many. Wait, I think it's Hisui and Zorark after looking through all of these. I do really like the Decidueye variant, but I like regular Decidueye more, so I think, I think this is the best. Legend though, I think it's Zapdos, but my favorite Gen 8 Pokemon. I think it's pretty easy, it's Phalanx. It's such a cool Pokemon, just a home run of a new Pokemon. But that leaves us with the newest generation. Time to make some judgment cards calls that I don't think I've even tried to make at this point. Three segment Dunsparce is pretty cool and maybe I'll try and get one eventually. Fire? Ooh, I really like the Pepper Monster. I kind of want to say the Fire Goldfish, but I haven't used it at all, like ever. So it might be this eventually, but for now it's it's the Pepper Monster. Water. It's got to be one trio. <laughs> He's a walking, talking W. Grass. It might be the new Tentacruel. This guy, a very unique and cool Pokemon. Electric. Oh, come on. I don't even know why I hesitated. <laughs> it's Belly Bolt. I love Belly Bolt. It's so cute. Ice. I have not used the Ice Panther Legend, but it's so Oh, sick. It is such a cool Pokemon. I haven't used it at all, but I think I have to pick it. I've made videos like way back in the day of like what animals should become Pokemon, and this was one of them. I do like Bax Caliber, so it's tough to pick between the two, but I, I think it's the Ice Panther. Fighting, though. I think it's definitely, I, I think it's the Great Tusk over here. Poison. Claude Sire's grown on me. This thing is so silly. <laughs> Ground. I always wanted a moose as well, and we finally got one. Flying. Flamigo? I think it might be Flamigo? Psychic. Yeah, nah, this thing is so sick. Bug. I think it's Slitherwing. Rock. I think it's Cloth. Ghost. This is probably the proper place to put the Ghost Primate. One of the cooler evolutions we've ever gotten. Dragon. Roaring Moon. Easy. Dark. Roaring Moon. No. <laughs> I'll pick something else. For variety, I'll do the Goldfish, but it might as well be Roaring Moon again. Steel. I really like Tinkaton. I actually would have loved this thing to be a second pseudo legendary. I, I really do like this thing. It's such a unique Pokemon. Fairy. Come on, it's Doc's button. Starter. This one's actually kind of tough. No, it's 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 Foy Coco. It's Foy Coco for sure. Gimmick form. The walking, talking W. <laughs> Legend. Might be cried on, actually. You use it so often when you play Scarlet. I just, yeah, I've gotten attached to it. But my favorite Pokemon of this generation, that is not difficult. It's Belly Bolt. It's, it's definitely Belly Bolt. <laughs> Look at this guy. <laughs> but now for my favorite of every typing. Wow. Dunsparce might be my favorite normal type. I think it actually is. I really wish it got a better evolution. I'm still upset about it, but I'm starting to accept the Dunsparce more and more. All right, fire. It's Charizard. I love Charizard. Water. Oh my God. This is actually really tough. Poliwrath would be the original, but then we got Politoed that overtook it. And we got Froki. I genuinely don't know the answer to this, but I think it's Politoed. I've used it in so many playthroughs. I've collected cards for it. You know, it was the frog Pokemon I always wanted, and it might get replaced with Froki or Greninja someday, but I think it's Politoed barely. Grass, Decidueye. Electric, 
This one's kind of tough, actually. I don't know if it's Belly Bolt already. It might actually be Belly Bolt. I just love this thing so much. It is so silly and so cute. Ice, Mamoswine. <laughs> Fighting, that's my champ. Poison, Nino King. Ground, picking Mamoswine again. It's my favorite. Flying, Rayquaza. Psychic, probably Reuniclus. Bug, oh, Bug's tough. Bug is really tough. Oh, wow. I think it's Volcarona. Rock? I think it's Agron. I'm glad I put this here instead of Steel. Ghost. I think I gotta go Aegislash. Dragon. What is my favorite dragon? It's between Garchomp, Gudra, and Roaring Moon. I think it might be Roaring Moon eventually. I think it's Gudra. This decision is very competitively based because most dragon types are so good. Garchomp was banned when I learned competitive and I never really got to use it. I really do love Garchomp though. I really ended up falling in love with Gudra. This one is subject to change. Dark, I think this is a good place for Greninja. Steel, the Regislash. Fairy, I think it's Doxbun. Doxins are one of my favorite things in the world. I've always wanted to have a Doxin Pokemon. We really got some cool Pokemon for my happiness in this generation. I'm a big fan of that. Starter. I think it's Decidueye. I really love Froakie and Greninja, but I there's just something about this starter. It is so unbelievably cool to me. He's Robin Hood. He's, he's got a whoopew. It's, it's so freaking cool. It, I don't know how they came up with it. It is such a sick Pokemon. Oh, what is this? Like weird, the, the weird forms, the different forms. I feel like I'm learning that I like the idea of regional variants way more than I actually love them. Right now, now, stupidly, it's Wug Trio. I don't know if I actually love Wug Trio or I just love how ridiculous it is. Either way, that's what my heart is saying. So I went with it. Legendary Rayquaza and the ultimate Mamoswine. But on to some interesting questions here. My team, Mamoswine, Machamp. Aegislash, Reuniclus, Greninja, Rayquaza. I wouldn't say these are my six favorite Pokemon, but if I'm making a team to battle with out of my favorites, they're all really good Pokemon, competitively speaking. I mean, Machamp, maybe it's losing a little bit of its luster, but I still love it. I think that's my favorite team. These are some interesting options. Favorite regional bird, not even a question, not even a question. Favorite regional mammal, this is absolutely a question. I think it's Diggersby. Bug, definitely Vikavolt. Pseudo Legends. Last time I had to make this decision, I went with Gudra. I'm gonna go with Garchomp this time. Pikachu clone. Oh, you can't give me Chonkachu. I'm choosing it every time. Evolution. Sylveon. Fossil. I guess Tyrantrum. Regional form. I do like regional forms. Like, I love them a lot, but like, they might just be too new. I haven't gotten too attached to them yet. Oh, he's Zorark. This thing's very cool. Gigantamax. I never really got to use Gigantamax Machamp. I was so happy that I got a new form, but I just never did anything with it. And, and Chonkachu's so funny. He's, he's so chonky, so, uh, you know. Favorite baby. I think it's Ryolu. Box art legend. Oh. Rayquaza. <laughs> Mythical. Oh, this is an interesting question. I'm gonna go Arceus. It's Arceus, come on. Ultra Beast, it was always Guzzlord. Paradox. Ooh, oh, Roaring Moon. Roaring Moon's so cool. Favorite type, fighting. Favorite Pokeball, where is it? Come on, you gotta have it, right? No, where's the GS ball? No. Pretend that's the GS ball. Favorite Vavillon, ooh. Blue and yellow is so gorgeous. I love that color combination. Favorite new Evo, Mamoswine. And with that, we are done all of my favorite Pokemon. This was really fun to do. It took way longer than I expected, but if you guys enjoyed this, let me know and we'll do the shiny version. Until then.